Hello everyone and welcome to my channel and in today's video I'm going to be showing you some things that you can make for your doll out of a bandana. So what you'll need is a bandana. I'm just using a red one. Some a doll. Sorry, I was saying the wrong thing. <laughs> and some twine. So the twine's just going to act as a belt, but yeah, that's all you'll need. So the first thing we want to do is take our bandana and we want to fold it to where it's a triangle because what we're making for our doll, it will need that triangular shape. So then you want to take your doll and raise her arms because this is going to be like an off the shoulder dress and you just want to lay it out and make sure it's the right length. You can always shorten it if you want. So then just take it and wrap one end over her shoulder and tuck it in and that's going to go as a strap and then you want to take the other and wrap it around to the front and this is where our twine is going to come in it's going to um hold that so you just want to hold your little piece over her stomach sorry my camera just flipped right there um so you just want to Make sure that it's over her stomach and then take the twine, which this is going to kind of act as a belt. And you want to wrap it around her multiple times to give it some thickness. But before you do that, you want to tie it, of course, so it doesn't come undone. But now you just see me wrapping it around her and... It's really beginning to look like a Moana dress now that I think about it, but it's really, really cute. It definitely fits her very well. And the great part is it was a no-sew doll dress, so that's really good. And then you just want to tuck it in to where, like, you can't really see that you tied it around. It just looks like a real dress, if that makes sense. And there you have it, her dress. She looks so cute. Okay, you guys, so now we're going to be making a skirt for our doll out of this gorgeous red bandana. So what you'll need is your bandana again, some twine, and of course your doll. So, I'm using Julie, and you just want to take your doll and lay her across your table, and then this time you want to unfold your bandana because we're making a skirt. So, you want to lay it over your doll, and then you want to fold it where the bandana is approximately half of your doll, so that way it will make just a long skirt and cover half of your doll. Now you can always shorten your skirt if you want to, but I just left mine long. So now what you want to do is take it and you want to wrap it around kind of um, like what we did with the dress. So as you can see, I'm just like um, wrapping it around. So just like tuck it in and then so only one part is left out and then you just take your twine or a hair tie. I decided to trade out my twine for a hair tie so I'm using a scrunchie instead which it does not matter what color your hair tie is because we're going to be covering that up with the top fabric so you just want to slide it on through her feet and then you want to move it all the way up to the top and then slide it down so you'll have enough fabric to fold over top of the hair tie and then you just want to fold it over top so it actually looks like the real top of an actual skirt and I just think this is so cute and such a great outfit. Okay, you guys, so now we're going to be making a little sleeveless crop top or off the shoulders top. It all depends on the length that you make it. So what you want to do is fold your bandana like a hot dog. Like whenever I was in preschool, we called it hot dog folding. And then whenever you fold it, 
the other way it's called hamburger folding it's just weird I'm sorry um, so just hot dog fold your bandana and then you just lay it over your doll like you see me doing here and you just want to tuck one part in and then take the other part go over it and then you just twist it and tuck it in the back this one was really really simple it didn't call for twine not unless you just want to use it as a little um front decoration by like taking it and tying it in a bow like I'm demonstrating here which it all depends on how you tie it like whenever I tied it I realized that I didn't really like it that way but you guys can tie it however you want to I'm just tying it in a bow and again this is optional this time so the twine you do not have to use it's not necessary um but yeah, that's pretty much it. This was super cute and super easy. I just love how easy these are and it only calls for about two things. This one really only one thing like the bandana and it turned out just super duper cute. I love this so much. And that's pretty much all you need to make this bandana top and as you can see I did not like the way it turned out um but yeah that's pretty much it okay you guys I am back with our very last outfit or accessory so what you'll need is just your bandana and again you want to hot dog fold this and we're going to be making a little headband for our doll now you want to make sure that the thickness it can be as thick or as thin as you want and there is plenty of different ways you can tie this as you can see I'm tying mine over top for the first look and this would be really good if you were doing like a cultured theme photo because it kind of reminds me of like the African or Haitian headwear like I have a doll that I got from Haiti once and she has a little bandana thing like this over top this also reminds me of Rosie the Riveter a bit um, but yeah you can tie it like that or you can kind of roll it under where it's smooth on top I'm just tying it um, plenty of different ways in this little no so clip um, so I'm just doing over the top of the head again it does kind of look like a little um, Haitian or African American headpiece. So I just think it's really cute. And then another way that you can tie it is underneath, which I think this definitely reminds me of something from Julie's Kid. I don't know. It just reminds me of like the 1970s <laughs> for some reason. I do not know why, but I just think it looks super cute on Julie like this. And I feel like the other way, it would look very cute on Kira. Um, but yeah. <music>